during the war, after the war, Firestone came back to Liberia. This was the concept that they had given to the United States workers, to our, our union's brothers in America was that they were doing so much more for workers in Liberia. And so they could not expand on benefits and other stuff for workers in America and Canada. And so the workers felt that, you know, it, they, we were their colleagues. And so they gave into that for some time. And then they decided to come and do their, their own investigation to see whether what was obtaining was actually the truth. And they came on the ground, they came to Liberia, and they made some assessment. And they eventually found out that what was obtaining was not the truth. And that's when they said, well, we will have to get to our brothers and work along with them. And so when the Wildcat strike came about, that was an opportunity. And then that was when they, they came in and we, you know, uh, got uh, affiliated with them. We got connected with them through the Liberal Federation of Labor Unions and the uh, uh, Congress of Industrial Organization called CONATU, Congress of National Trade Unions Organization. So the both of the, the, the both uh, centers came in with the help of the United States Workers Union and then the American Cent Center for International Labor Solidarity also joined them. And that's how, you know, we, we, we got along with them and then they started building our capacity. Through those interventions, we were also able to get in touch with uh, the International Labor Rights Forum. They made several visits here. Firestone became, uh, became uh, real notable for the inhumane living and working condition. And so almost every international human rights organization and trade union movement wanted to come in to see what was obtaining. But when these international organizations came to us and we took them in the feed, they took out the cameras and talked to workers and talked to uh, you know, workers and their families. And when those information got out there, you know, people felt that something needed to be done and the company too knew that <laughs> she had to do the right thing.